Easy Drummer 3 adds the fully featured grid editor that you've come to know and love from Superior Drummer 3 and Easy Bass. However, there's some important songwriting refinements that make it easier than ever to compose grooves from scratch. First, a humanize engine has been created with the songwriter in mind. This engine uses information from the hundreds of thousands of grooves that TuneTrack has recorded with real drummers to build velocity and timing styles that can instantly be applied to your programmed grooves. Here I have a simple drum groove that I drew in manually with human eyes off. While the samples themselves sound good, the performance is static and lifeless because all of the velocities are the same and there's no micro timing. Now I'll simply select all notes and choose a human eye style to bring this groove to life. The other velocity styles in the Humanize section work for grooves that are programmed in that style, including halftime, double time, and blast beat. Here, I have a manually programmed halftime shuffle beat with a triplet feel. I'll then use the halftime velocity style to transform this very static sounding groove into a real halftime shuffle performance. And next, a double time groove. And finally, a blast beat. Humanized styles can be applied to individual instruments. They do not need to be applied globally to the entire MIDI file. This is useful if you wanted to, say, draw in a new hi-hat pattern on an existing groove. The original groove parts don't need humanizing in this case because they were recorded by a real drummer, but we can easily match the hats to this groove with the right velocity style. You can even adjust the micro timing for the selected notes in the More menu to better suit your performance. Micro timing makes very small adjustments to the placement of notes on the grid, mimicking the natural variation of a real drummer. The difference here is quite subtle, and much experimentation went into finding just the right amount of timing adjustments. Finally, the grid editor also makes it easy to draw two note articulation patterns, like the kind commonly found on hi hat and ride. Here, I'll start by creating a closed hi-hat progression with the closed edge and closed tip articulation for one bar. Then, when I close the articulation menu, simply draw in the rest of the notes and they'll follow the same two-note pattern. This, in combination with the velocity styles, can make realistic hi-hat programming simple and faster than ever.